But anyways, we're just we're just doing what works these days. I'm not I'm not calling myself an all natural mom. I'm just calling myself a mom with four little kids who is just trying to do the best that she can right now. Do you guys feel me? Thumbs up if you guys feel me. So I'm putting videos on YouTube of me doing my makeup and talking to you about life. You guys, where in the heck have I been? Where have I been? I've been taking care of all the babies and kids and um, just, I feel like, trying to keep my head above the water. I'm four months postpartum now. And, um, yeah, I'm four months postpartum. I feel like I'm going to be all over the place in this video because it feels so awkward filming because I haven't filmed in so long. But I want to film. I want to get back into it. I thought about doing, like, a vlog today. Um, but then I was like, you know, I'll just do a get ready with me. I haven't done one of these. I don't even... It's been probably years since I've done one of these, which is kind of insane to me. Um, I just use the Complexion Rescue um, Tinted Hydrating Gel Cream from Bare Minerals, which I've been using forever. I'm actually going to use a little bit more of that because my skin feels so dry right now. This is in the color Vanilla. It is morning time right now, obviously. It's like late morning. My kids are all playing with stickers right now. Um, those like Melissa and Doug reusable stickers that like they can't put on walls. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Sorry, is this weird that I'm using my viewfinder? So I'm like looking at you guys while I'm doing my makeup. <laughs> Sorry, I know it's a little scary. Look a little scary. The dark circles have been very prevalent these days. I've just been struggling postpartum this time and I feel like I've needed to just tell myself, like I've needed to just be gentle with myself and um, not have the crazy expectations that I find myself having. And with that, like I've taken a fast from Instagram and social media and I've backed away from my channel. More than anything, it's been so that I don't have any other commitments other than taking care of my kids and trying to keep my house somewhat in order. Somewhat in order. I use that term very loosely <laughs> right now. I feel like I've evolved into kind of finding my place in the YouTube community. Like, I hope that when you come to my channel, you see someone who is real. If you meet me in real life, you're going to see that I'm the same person in real life as I am on my channel, you know? There are really cool opportunities on my channel to make some income. Um, there are cool opportunities to try new products, and if I like them, I get to share them with you. But I feel more than anything else that I found that just being a real mom and sharing the struggles of motherhood, um, the sharing, sharing the chaos of being a millennial mom is what you're going to find on my channel, you know? You're going to find a mom who takes her kids to McDonald's some days and chooses to buy organic rice at Walmart the next day, you know? Um, my kids are screaming. Hold on one second. Okay, we're back. Prime example, I hope that that's what you find at my ch on my channel, is um, just real life. You know what I'm saying? So I tried this new tea from Celestial Seasonings. Season Is it Celestial Season? Celestial Seasons? I don't know. I tried a new tea. It's a sleepy time tea, which I think is what they call any tea with no caffeine, right? Um, but it has echinacea in it and some other good stuff for your immune system. So I figured I'd try that. Isn't this cup cute, you guys? This is a little Bambi cup. My mother-in-law got me this. She's so darn sweet. She got these from the Disney store, and she got me this Bambi one um, for Christmas, I think, last year. And it's, like, the best shape. Do you guys have that cup that you reach for that has, like, the best shape? And you just reach for it amidst all the other cups, um, and you only use your other cups if, like, this cup is dirty. That's kind of like this cup for me. I was using like all natural products for a while, you guys, and then I just now I'm like, we're, I'm just trying to just just using what I have and what I like, I guess. I haven't been purchasing any more makeup. Um, 
I still am using like Bare Minerals. Um, I like my RMS highlighter. Uh, one thing I really have been liking is this Burt's Bees um, foundation. I've been mixing a little bit of this with this if I need a little bit more coverage, and I really like that. It is more expensive even though it's from the drugstore, but the ingredients, I mean, what does it say? It's like 99% natural or something crazy. 98.9% .9 natural. So I guess I'll pay a little bit more money for that. But anyways, we're just, we're just doing what works these days. I'm not, I'm not calling myself an all-natural mom. I'm just calling myself a mom with four little kids who is just trying to do the best that she can right now. Do you guys feel me? Thumbs up if you guys feel me. So I'm putting videos on YouTube of me doing my makeup and talking to you about life. I feel like I've kind of been out of the loop with people these days. I need a mirror for this. This is a little too a little too risque for me. So how are you guys doing? Comment down below and let me know what's new in your life. How have you guys been? Um, what's new? What's new? I feel so far removed from so much, even like on YouTube and stuff. I feel like I don't know a lot of the stuff that's happening because I kind of been a little bit um, just taking a break. So what's happening? Comment down below. I'm using the Living Luminizer from RMS. I also have the Magic Luminizer. Um, which is like a goldy color and it's so so nice. I really like it But I'm gonna use the gray or not the gray. I'm gonna use the cooler one. Um, it's not even the suit It's just it's more of like a white um, But when you blend it in it's not but I'm using this um, Because I think I'm gonna use that goldy one more in the um, spring and summer when it's a little warmer outside so there we go and I think that's as good as it's gonna get today guys life is good honestly life is really good I feel like um, we're kind of settling into a stillness right now with um, just having Ingrid and just kind of like finding our flow with things and just um, it's March now and it's still snowing outside thank you Michigan but I'm just like anticipating spring and I feel like our family is we're going into a new season where I don't think we're gonna have any more babies and so it's just kind of like what does that look like I have um, kind of given my capsule wardrobe a facelift gotten back into really being intentional with minimalism in my life my wardrobe's been like a big to do because my body has changed so much since having Ingrid and my hips and my butt and my thighs are wider and so it's really been kind of a feat to figure out how to dress myself so I've been trying to work on my wardrobe work on finding out what works for me what I feel good in because the stuff that I use pre-pregnancy doesn't work now and the stuff that I use when I was pregnant isn't working right now because I'm not pregnant and I'm definitely not pre-pregnancy weight or body shape which is totally fine but it's just trying to figure out you know kind of how to how to navigate through that and how to dress for that so I want to show you guys Ingrid real fast I might as well show you guys her while I've got the camera out so you can see how big this little girl is getting you guys look at her Ingrid say hi can you say hello? She sees herself in the viewfinder. Look at this precious miracle baby. Yeah, you're the rainbow baby. You see hi? She looks just like John, like all my other children. <laughs> if you've seen my husband, blonde hair, blue eyes. We don't look anything alike. So when you see our children, you're like, that child looks just like John. She's such a sweet ray of sunshine in our family. She is sweet, she's easygoing and happy, and um, just a blessing. Oh, she's such a blessing, and everyone loves her. Like, all the kids fight over who gets to hold her and smooch her and all the things, you know. And so we just love her. I hope you guys are all doing well. Please comment down below. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. She's gonna eat my face because she's hungry now. Um, oh, I think you need your diaper changed again, too. Yep, this is what happens when I try to film. <laughs> yes, but it's okay, though. That's all right, huh? That's okay. I miss you guys, I love you, and um, I can't wait to see you guys soon. See you guys later, bye.